in the river, the glacial rivers, so it's running strong. David styling his croc. Did he ro are his pants rolled up far enough? I'm not thinking so. Let's touch and go. Water splashing up on his pants, but he's getting higher ground. No panic yet. Ah, he has dry pants. Woohoo! That'll wake you up. Well done. Alright, here comes Sarah. She's rocking the cross. They're even color coordinated. She's even smiling. Nothing like a good full soak in the morning. Very good technique. Side step, pulls forward, facing into the river. And something else is puckered up. Yay! <laughs> Last, certainly not the mountain goat. Yep, it's up to her knees. We knew that would happen. And go! Yeah! Woohoo! So there's our excitement for the morning. Catch y'all later. All right, working our way up our first morning climb, which is quite a doozy. Yes, it but, is. But uh, starting to get some views. A little cloudy and hazy. Um, supposed to get some rain sometime later today. Unsure exactly when. I'm uh, getting kind of different, different reports on it. But uh, we'll take it dry as long as we can get it. So getting a good start to the day. We had a, you saw the river crossing that we did. And uh, always fun to kind of start with that. Got, got our feet washed off though. It's always good to start yeah. with clean feet. Might so, move that dirt off my legs. Yeah. All right, we're gonna keep marching our, our way up here, finish this climb and then on to the next one. We'll talk to y'all in a little bit. All right, we made a stop just for a break and get some water out of this lovely creek. And blueberries. And some blueberries, yeah. Wow, blueberries. Got a bunch of blueberries here. <clears throat> like this one. Yeah, very juicy. Very juicy. Ooh, look at how big that guy is. Yeah. Right here. Oh, man, look at that guy. Oh, this one. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Look at all of this. It's a blueberry fest. That's a big one. All right. No, it's good, too. <laughs> it's kind of like a hiker box. Yeah. <clears throat> All right. We've got about five more miles that we're going to do for lunch. And, uh, so far, the weather's holding out. It's still pretty cloudy. Um, and we're hoping that uh, hoping it'll just stay cloudy and no rain. So, all right, well, we're, uh, we're going to move on and get to our lunch spot. We'll talk to you all then. This is mile 25-22. We just got top of our climb. And uh, what do you think, River? The views don't disappoint? Worth it. Yeah. It was a long climb today, but we're on top. Now we're going to those trails way down there.
the trail, see you in a while. Come across another it's called Alpine Lake. Oh, beautiful. It's gorgeous. Again, on a hot day, this would probably be a great place to swim. on here. Pretty little creek slash waterfall. The creek. I don't care. Show them the clouds. <laughs> That's That's nice creek. Yeah, we got some clouds really moving in on us. Um, so we're hoping we're hoping going to blow through. We're definitely moving in that direction. Uh, we got about two miles down, and then we got a four and a half mile up for our afternoon exercise climb. Are we all excited about the climb up the mountain? Yeah! All right, you can just hear that enthusiasm. It's great. All right, we'll talk to y'all a little later. Well, hey, everybody. Hey, this is a wrap up for day 144, I think. Um, and we're sorry, we have to make this quick. It's starting to sprinkle. So uh, we had a good day, a tough day, tough day today. We did, uh, what did we do, 23? 23.89 miles, yeah. Close to 24. And uh, total ascent about 6,400 ish. Mm. And total descent about 6,500. Mm. So, well, yeah, that explains was, why our knees and everything ache. Yeah. <laughs> it, it was, um, I mean, it was great effort. We got it all done, but yeah. hanging over us was the rain, but it didn't yeah. yet, it just materialized now. So, we're going to dive it's into just our starting. Tent. So I have to give a shout out to the inReach weather. It said it wouldn't start till seven, and it's about quarter till. So <laughs> yeah. that's pretty, that's pretty good. So we'll take it. But um, today was, uh, we didn't do a whole lot of videos after lunch because yeah. the weather looked like it was coming in, and it was a slog up yeah. that up that hill. It was like what, almost five miles? Yeah, about four and a half miles. Yeah, and about ten and a half. Ten and a half percent average grade, but it was, at some points it was fourteen, fifteen. Oh, and some was like, and there were blowdowns. Yeah, they, and there was overgrowth that you had to go through, you know, and there were rocks and mud sliding out of everywhere, and I fell twice. I fell once. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah I, you know, I hate to say it, but the the trail over the last ten miles have been has been the worst trail we've done on the PCT. Uh, just between blowdowns and overgrowth, and but, and then the trail just deteriorating where it's you know. Um, I don't rock, know. rock slides, mud slides, and things. Yeah, like that. just you know, sliding off. Um, in the in the trees, where there wasn't any of the bushes and stuff like that, actually, the tread was pretty good most of the time, unless there had been a big blow down. Right. You know, cause yeah. It was just like, man, it was just. But yeah, made made for put all that together, made for a, a pretty tough day. But we got through it. Like I said, we, we kind of hunkered down and did what we got to do. Yeah. Um, River, you know, he's young, young, youngish guy. And uh, triple crowner, he was just shaking his head. He was just, <laughs> this is just... He's just trying to make us old people feel good. And then, uh, what was something that uh, Sarah said? She goes, well, Yeah, the first 2,000 miles was just training for this. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. Oh, man. so, tomorrow we've got a um, got big climb, about eight and a half miles of climb. Um, so, that'll be, our, that'll be our wine for tomorrow. It'll be our wine. Yeah. But yeah. the grade. The grade is at least supposed to be better, not yeah. as steep. Yeah. And uh, if we did the same distance, we'd do 
over a thousand left less in uh, in the center. So yeah. it'll all fit all depend upon the weather and uh, depend upon the condition of the trail tomorrow. Right. We're, right now, again, if the weather holds out for tomorrow, uh, we've got a good shot that we can get in the day after tomorrow. We get into Stahican and be there that night, and then yeah, one day ahead of, of what we originally planned. So. But tomorrow will be the, the critical test for us. Yeah. So as was today. Yeah. So. All right. I'm, well, we're gonna I'm cut. Hurting. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I, I, I see some uh, vitamin I in our future. Big time. Yeah. All right. Uh, we're gonna cut it here just uh, so we can try to get in before it starts raining harder, and I'll show a real quick uh, overview of our tent site. All right. Happy trails, y'all. Take care, y'all. All right. All right. This is our tent site. Uh, we'll back up here a little bit. Okay. Bear with me here. So I walk back up to toward the trail. It's right off the trail, which is nice. But, uh, you can see a tent hazel, togo, there, and a river down in the middle. But good. Got a uh, creek running beside us, but this is luckily not the one we're getting water from because it's got a lot of glacier salt in it. But just up the trail here, not too far, is a clear creek kind of running down into that. So that worked out pretty well for us. All right, well, I'm going to cut it here. Y'all have a great night and we'll talk to y'all tomorrow.